And a warm welcome. Our venue for this game is the Emirates Stadium in North London. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And getting ready for a potentially thrilling contest. It's Arsenal up against Marseille. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Thomas Partey, number 34, Granit Xhaka, and number 8, Martin Odegaard. And this is the Arsenal starting eleven. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the focal point in attack is Gabriel Jesus. And here's how it looks for Marseille. It's the impressive Paul Lopez between the posts. Dimitri Payet starts with Genghis Under on the flanks. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Thank you, Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the game. And now they get the ball rolling. Chance to cross. A really meat and drink to the keeper under the circumstances. Arkadiusz Milik, Gendouzi, Bubakar Kamara, Milik, textbook defending inside the box. And attempting the through ball. In it goes, an early goal, no wonder they're celebrating. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. And so Marseille get the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? Wendouzi. Oh, he's given the ball away. Jesus. Now, potential danger. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. And there's the delivery. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. William Saliba. Bubakar Kamara. Genghis Under. A fine reading of the situation. Perfectly fair tackle, and it will be a corner. Who can he pick out? Well, the clearance, half-hearted. Perfect challenge. Matteo Guendouzi. Gerson. 
Arkadiusz Milik. Well, he's got to be disappointed with that pass. Thomas Partey. Tommy Yasu. An encouraging Arsenal move. And it's Gabriel Jesus. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Well, a second goal for them here. And a tidy ball. Well, they've given him too much space. Corner coming up. Payet delivering. Is he able to dispatch it? Gendouzi. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Renduzzi. It's a neat move. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Oh, what an opportunity. Try to lob the keeper. And he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. Trying to pick out a teammate. It hasn't come to very much. Tommy Yasu. It's with Gabriel. And giving the ball away. Arkadiusz Milik. Dimitri Payet with it. Bubakar Kamara. Now with Cengiz Zunde. Over the touchline for a throw-in. As you can see, Arsenal are seeing less of the ball. But their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. Opportunity! There it is! A goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, Marseille might still be trailing, but the belief is visibly back. Granit Xhaka Thomas now and they need to get tighter here he has time to play it over oh it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee and maybe they'll be able to level this up well, there might have been a case for a yellow card, but the referee didn't see it that way. Well, Derek, it's a foul, yes. A penalty, absolutely. But for me, it's not a yellow card. The ref has got that right. And the keeper denies them from the spot. Martin Odegaard. On to Cengiz Undev. Matteo Guendouzi. It's with Milik. Cengiz Under. Delivering it into the box. 
Simple save, really. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. This looks threatening. Determined defending. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, it was a rampant display by Arkadiusz Mil. So into the second half, can Marseille pick themselves up after that first 45? Gerson. Matteo Guendouzi. Boubacar Camara. Not a great pass. Dangerous looking attack. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Can he convert? Oh, good reflexes from the keeper, and the danger averted. Trying to deliver it accurately, and never quite had the header on the target. Gerson Payet perfectly positioned to take it away Genghis Under can they create something from here Bubakar Kamara could be brilliant save Martin Odegaard racing forward, trying to catch them out. Looks as though they might make real progress on the counter-attack. Not so. Intercepting it intelligently. Gabriel Jesus. Is it going to be? And it's gone in! Will they be stopped from this position? Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Substitution time it is here. Underway again with the score at 3-1. So half an hour remaining. It needs an accurate cross. And the problem not completely solved. Well, they can keep possession now. Granit Xhaka moving the ball effectively well didn't go to plan in the end attending to his defensive chores well it looked highly promising but they got nothing out of it Genghis Under Marseille moving the ball forward with purpose and a good looking ball well nothing comes of it in the end because the flag has gone up Stuart well he knew where the space was but he's just been too eager and that's why he's offside Martinelli run it magnificently and intercepted has eyes for goal! And a fine stop. Well, you've got to savour such moments. 
A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. 20 minutes remaining. It's with Dieng. And players waiting in the centre. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. Alexander Zinchenko. And attempting the through ball. And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. Gay. Dimitri Payet with it. Couldn't keep the ball. And Marseille with the ball once more. Payet. Matteo Guendouzi. Gay. A really intense pressure applied. It's a neat move. And you don't want to lose possession there. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Martin Odegaard. A sloppy pass. Oh, he looks threatening. It looks promising. Oh, there it is! A lifeline in this game! And what a finale we could be in for here! Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. Well, the action underway once more, and no shortage of entertainment. 3 2. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch. Here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. Not a good pass. Number three, Kieran Tien. Granit Xhaka. Gabriel Jesus. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Arsenal have given it away. Well, if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Genghis Under. Not advantage with them. Referee says play on. Valentin Rogier. And a good looking ball. Really good high press. And running through to the keeper. And the referee blows his whistle. Now we can say it officially Arsenal have won this game. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end. So much to admire about the performance put in by Gabriel Jesus. Well, I'm not concerned about him missing a few chances. The main thing is he kept on getting into the right areas and he scored a very good goal as well.